Did you know the safety belt was invented by a caterpillar? Man hadn't appeared on Earth when the caterpillar of the cabbage butterfly millions of years ago was already making its belts. Let's look at one as it repeats the sequence of actions it inherited as part of its genetic patrimony. After weaving on the woody support a silk button that will act as an anchor, the insect grabs it very carefully with the hooks of its hind legs. In this way, the posterior part of the animal has a solid support. The animal then begins to emit an almost invisible filament and fixes an end of it to the branch beside its body. Then, bending its head back in a semicircle, it attaches the other end of the filament to the opposite end. The result is a very thin arch of silk. To give it the necessary resistance, the insect repeats the operation 30 or 40 times until the belt, composed of many slender filaments bound together, assumes the desired thickness. You will often see several cabbage butterfly caterpillars that have matured at the same time working in synchronism. Romieu, the famous French naturalist of the 18th century, gave us the first description of this ingenious maneuver, minutely illustrated in his Notes for the History of Insects. The sequence concludes when the caterpillar inserts its head and thorax under the shiny silk arch, remaining a prisoner. Now, with its body solidly anchored to the support, it can perform the metamorphosis without the risk of falling. In fact, the next day, it removes its larval clothing to transform itself into a chrysalis. The old skin cracks along the back and, pushed by a series of rhythmic contractions, slips towards the bottom. Until it reveals the tail with its cremaster, a point with minute hooks that immediately attaches to the silk button, anchoring the insect again. A few twisting movements cause the rest of the skin to fall off. Two weeks later, the conclusive phase of the metamorphosis takes place. Now, the rigid carapace of the chrysalis cracks under the force exercised from the inside. The silk belt resists the strong traction, guaranteeing the insect the necessary stability. Nimble and secure, the legs freed from the pupil sheath grab the branch, and the butterfly can finally extract its wings and abdomen from the case. appear to be very small, but within 30 seconds they unfold like the train of a bridal gown. 